a fiery start to the year. Mount Etna erupts again, throwing ash into the sky of Sicily. The new year has barely begun. Yet Mount Etna has already announced itself with thunderous force, rising more than 3,300 meters above the eastern coast of Sicily. Europe's most active volcano erupted once again, ejecting ash, incandescent fragments, and volcanic gases high into the atmosphere. The eruption painted the sky in shades of gray and brown, a dramatic contrast to the winter landscape below, and served as a powerful reminder that Etna is never truly at rest. For scientists, Etna's renewed activity is not unexpected. This volcano is among the most closely monitored on Earth precisely because of its frequent eruptions. Etna occupies a uniquely complex geological setting at the boundary where the African tectonic plate pushes northward beneath the Eurasian plate. This slow but relentless collision creates fractures and weaknesses in the crust, allowing magma from deep within the mantle to rise toward the surface. Over time, pressure builds as molten rock accumulates in underground reservoirs until the system releases energy in the form of eruptions. The ash plume generated by this eruption is a visible signature of that internal process. Volcanic ash is not soft like fireplace ash. It consists of sharp, microscopic fragments of rock and volcanic glass created when magma is violently shattered by expanding gases. Once lofted into the air, these particles can travel hundreds or even thousands of kilometers, depending on wind patterns. In Sicily, ash fall dusted rooftops, roads, and farmland temporarily disrupting daily life and prompting local authorities to issue safety advisories. From an aviation standpoint, Etna's ash clouds are a serious concern. Even small concentrations of ash can melt inside jet engines, causing abrasion, blockage, or engine failure. This is why eruptions often trigger flight delays or airport closures in and around Sicily. Volcanologists and meteorological agencies work together, combining satellite imagery with atmospheric models to predict ash dispersion and minimize risks to air traffic. What makes Edna particularly fascinating is its reputation as an open conduit volcano. Unlike volcanoes that remain dormant for long periods before producing massive, catastrophic eruptions, Etna frequently releases magma through summit craters and flank vents. This steady outpouring of lava and ash allows pressure to be relieved gradually. However, this does not mean Etna is harmless. Its eruptions can vary significantly in style and intensity, sometimes shifting rapidly from gentle lava flows to powerful explosive events.
seismic data collected during the eruption revealed increased volcanic tremor continuous ground vibrations caused by magma and gas moving through underground channels. These tremors act like a stethoscope pressed against the volcano's chest, allowing scientists to listen to the flow of molten rock below. In addition, ground deformation measurements showed subtle swelling of the volcano's flanks, indicating magma intrusion at shallow depths, together with elevated sulfur dioxide emissions detected in the plume. These signals suggest that fresh magma is actively feeding the eruption. Beyond Immediate Hazards Etna's eruptions play a crucial role in shaping Sicily's natural environment over long time scales. Lava flows gradually extend the coastline, while layers of ash enrich the soil with minerals such as potassium and phosphorus. This volcanic fertility supports vineyards, orchards, and crops that thrive on Etna slopes making the region both geologically dangerous and agriculturally productive. It is a striking example of how destructive and life-giving forces can coexist. Etna also serves as a natural laboratory for volcanologists worldwide. Because eruptions occur so frequently, scientists can test monitoring techniques improve eruption forecasting models, and refine emergency response strategies. Lessons learned here are often applied to more dangerous volcanoes elsewhere, including those capable of producing far more explosive and deadly eruptions. As the ash slowly settles and the eruption enters a new phase, Mount Etna once again stands as a symbol of Earth's inner vitality. Its fiery outburst at the start of the year is not merely a local event, but part of a much larger planetary story one written by tectonic forces, molten rock, and the constant reshaping of our world. For the people of Sicily, it is a familiar spectacle etched into daily life. For scientists, it is another chapter in an ongoing effort to understand, predict, and live alongside one of nature's most powerful expressions.